Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much, well deserved. What's good, YouTube? This is Austin Sweet here, and you're watching the Sweet Life Dakota in Austin. Welcome back to the channel, guys, and happy Friday to everyone out there. How's everyone doing? Today, I know yesterday was supposed to be a top 10 Thursdays, but obviously the phone that I do my videos on did not have enough charge to actually do the video. But we are doing a top 10 today, and it's gonna be my top 10 old school rap songs. And I do have a list, as you can see right here on my LG for the single focus. There you go. And I'm just gonna hop right into it. So coming in at number 10, we have Gangsta's Paradise by Coolio with LV. This was, <coughs> excuse me. This was actually my introduction to Coolio. I know Coolio put out It Takes a Thief, but this came off the Gangsta's Paradise album. This song, in my opinion, put Coolio on the map. Just basically talking about how we're always living a lie. Um, and just talking about how we're living in a gangster's world or their paradise. Um, it's actually a universally a great song. Check it out. And if you have, and if you can, try to find a live performance of it. Live performance, man. It's, uh, it's awesome. Okay, clocking in at number nine. Everyone says this is their favorite um, song by an NWA member, but it wasn't for me. It didn't make the top five, and that's Boys in the Hood um, by Easy e This put gangster rap on the map for what it was back in the day. Back in the day, it was just amazing. But Boys in the Hood, Easy e goes solo. Yeah, he goes solo in the song. He actually raps it solo. Um, so, all I'm saying is check out that song if you haven't already. Really good beat, too. That is just talking about boys, is talking about the people in, like, the neighborhood. At number eight, and there's a reason I put this at number eight. Um, number eight is Shook Ones Part Two by Mob Deep. Um, I put this on the list because there was a Hamilton reference. Them saying I'm only 19, but my mind is older. Um, when I heard Shook Ones Part 2, a great beat, by the way. The music video was even better, too. It's pretty much telling them, we got you stuck off the realness and all that. It came off their infamous album. The infamous Mob Deep. Um, that put them on the map, in my opinion, which is just mind-blowing song. It's awesome. All I'm saying is check that out if you haven't already. Number seven is Cream by the Wu-Tang Clan. Now, Cream in this one stands for Cash Rules Everything Around Me. That's what Cream stands for. Um, in my opinion, it's a really good song. Not my favorite. I mean, it's my favorite song by the Wu-Tang Clan, but there's more songs by um, the Wu-Tang Clan that I do enjoy. Also, the solo members' works are just really good, too. The video is good, too, and a great beat. It's just talking about how they they grew up like on the south side and moved and how they got popularity. It's really good. Coming out at number six, um, it could have, and then no, this is kind of where it kind of takes a hit for me and I have to think about it. Um, at number six, I'm putting straight out of Compton on the list. Um, I did put straight out of Compton on there by NWA, it's just basically to them talking about where they were, um, where they're from, talking about, um, like the background. But overall, go check that out in a minute, or, sorry, go check out Straight Outta Compton if you haven't already. Excuse me, one minute. Okay, sorry about that. Okay, we're coming into my top five and number five. This is where things also take a hit for me. People are like, oh, this song is good. It's my favorite old school rap song of all time. Well, it wasn't, it didn't, it made the top five, but it didn't make number one. At number five, I'm putting Regulate by Warren G with Nate Dogg. Um, in my opinion, it's a great song. Don't get me wrong. The beat's probably my favorite part. Um, it's just basically talking about how Warren G is going from, like the previous era, he's going into a whole new era of rap, 
basically introducing us to a new era of rap. That's what Regulate does. That's what Regulate did. Um, great song. I really like it. Number four is Gin and Juice, the classic Gin and Juice um, by Snoop Dogg. You guys should know that song. I mean, I mentioned it in my top ten rap songs, um, but these are my top ten old school rap songs. Um, but yeah, Gin and Juice, you guys should know that one. I'm not even going to go into detail on that song. I'm not. You guys should know what that song is and what that song is about. I'm just saying it. If you don't, uh, go listen to it for yourself. Number three, now this is where things kind of sort of take a hit for me, but number two takes a hit. Uh, number three, people put this as their favorite, but but it didn't make number one. And number three, I'm putting Big Papa by the Notorious B.I.G. at number three. Um, it's actually a good song. I love the beat on it. Um, Big Papa, that's a classic. You guys should know that one. I'm not going into detail about it. Um, but yeah, go check out that song if you haven't. Check out the music video, too. It's really good. Alright, coming in, we're coming down at the final two. This is kind of where things take a hit for me as well. People put this as their favorite old school rap song, but it just didn't make it for me. Um, coming in at number two, I'm putting It Was A Good Day by Ice Cube on at number two. So yeah, number two, It Was A Good Day. Um, it Was A Good Day is just basically talking, basically talking about Ice Cube's day, pretty much. The beat is good. There's a music video for it. Excuse me, there's a music video for it as well. I just haven't had the time to check it out yet. But check it out if you haven't. Coming in at number one, you guys should obviously know. Number one. Um, I'm not going to go into detail about it, but you guys should know what number one is. Number one and my favorite old school rap song of all time is Ambitions as a Rider. You guys should know that song. I'm not even going to go into detail about it. Um, if you want more detail, go check out um, the... Old, my top 10 rap songs and it'll be more detail I'm not going to go into detail um, about ambitions as a writer on this video you guys should know ambitions as a writer it's Tupac's statement after he got out um, so go check out that song if you haven't already I'm not going to go into detail and that'll do it for this top 10 guys thank you very much for watching if this video I'm going to do a challenge if this video gets 3 likes I will do another top 10 old school rap songs. I will do it. Till then, thank you guys very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure you give this video a thumbs up. Leave your feedback in the comments. And above all else, subscribe. Shout out the bell. Turn on all notifications so you don't miss the next upload. Matt Hamilton's channel link will be in the description below. Go subscribe to him. Um, hope everyone enjoys their Friday. Have a great weekend, everybody. And I'll see you guys next video.